perfect. Calling all Silver Shroud fans. I got an urgent mission. If you're a true fan, stop by the memory den and to talk to Kent Conley. The Silver Shroud needs you. Galaxy News Radio. When evil walks the streets of Boston, one man lurks in the shadows, shielding the innocent, judging the guilty. That guardian is the Silver Shroud. Today's episode, A Slaying in Scully Square. Uh, uh, just uh, down this alley. Well, well, well. Looks like someone got lost on the wrong side of the tracks. <laughs> yeah, wrong side of the tracks. I I'm just meeting a friend. No business of yours. Uh, perhaps I'll just call him. Now, if, if you'll excuse me. Not so fast, fancy pants. Your wallet and that snazzy briefcase you're carrying. Hand them over, now. I most certainly will not. Do you have any idea who... Oh, jeez, Louise. Why'd you go and do that? Because he could have made us, that's why. You want to spend another stretch in the pokey? Now. Let's see what's in this fancy case. Nothing. Papers, no cash, it's worthless. Ah, get his wallet. Suit like this has gotta have something. All right, all right, let's see. 20 bucks, a driver's license. Oh man, we done it this time. You know who this is? We just wasted Mayor Murphy! What? The Mayor Murphy? What in the blazes was he doing up here? Up in Scully Square! A mystery, to be sure. Who said that? Show yourself! You have murdered a man in cold blood. Justice must be served. It's the Silver Shroud! Let's get out of here! I ain't afraid of the Silver Shroud. You hear me? Come out and I'll do you like I did the mayor. Death has come for you, evildoer. And I am its shroud. City, right? That blow Here, hard from man, the Johnny. shadows, villain, you'll get his face the justice watch. of the silver oh, shroud. Your face walks into my store, what and you're not even screaming. You let me know week. if anything catches your fancy. Another exciting episode of the silver shroud. Did you say something about people screaming at you? That's right. Some newcomers have never seen a ghoul before. Can't handle a friendly face, I say. So you need some supplies? What's it like, you know, being a ghoul? Well, it's a lot worse when people always ask you about it all the time. But I guess I can't blame you. On the upside, I look pretty good for being over 220 years old. Now, will you buy anything? Wait, you're 220 years old? I'll go, okay, it's more like... 270 years, but don't go blabbing that to everyone. 
It's so Being funny. a ghoul means you live a long Mistress time. Of mystery. You stop counting on such a foul Do you know what it's like Tracking being that old? Mayor Murphy, who's up to some mischief. Actually, mayor. I do. So he wasn't here <laughs> Now you're kind of just making fun of me. If you were as old as I Hardly. was, you would have been here. around since before the war. So let's hear it. Come on. Tell me what the world was like case. before the war, if you're so ancient. I had a beautiful house, white picket fence, Square. and a lawn with the greenest grass you've Indeed, ever seen. They are my intrepid it was investigator. peaceful. It, would seem it was, our wasn't it? Was involved in a rather Sorry, the last thing you want to see is an old lady tearing he was here up. To meet well, with you're some either the most well-preserved ghoul I've ever factor. seen, or you're the second best so bullshitter and good neighbor. Ah. What the? Silver Shroud? And Mistress it's of the Mystery? Truth. All of it. You know, if you haven't already, you should check out the hotel breakfast. There's another pre-war ghoul so hanging around. Yeah. Murphy, we should get back to business. What are you picking up? Best listen to Let's my see what you have. Baby. It's a little bit of everything. I'll never talk. And you two are in over your heads. So be it. Death has come for you, evildoer. And I am its... Shroud. Shroud this, crime fighter. Later, suckers. Silver Shroud, you're shot. Uh, just a graze. You must go after him. No, we'll let our quarry flee for now. That bullet must be removed. And you're bleeding badly. Must get back to my... Hush now, Stoic Shroud. I'll take you to my parlor. It is close, and that wound is worrisome. The parlor? It's been so long. Indeed it has, old friend. Old love. Indeed it has. And now we must away. But the mayor, that hotel room. That fainty. We stumbled upon a most sinister plot, old friend. You're blocking my life. No, man. dear heart. The shroud stumbled. The yes. mistress maneuvered. I knew of the mayor's misdeeds for many days. I followed him to that fateful meeting with Fat Fahey. I was about to... Attention! Silver Shroud and Mistress of Mystery! This is Chief Corcoran of the Boston Police Department! We know you're in there! The you are both wanted in connection oh, with the murder of Mayor Murphy! Come out with your hands up! It would seem that Beta. our leaving the Good scene of the crazy. Scale slaughter was Babs terribly timed. Babs murders worse. Sometimes Incurring you just gotta escape a little. Finest is an unfortunate and unexpected I hear annoyance. You. It's a mess out there. It's but rough in the best of days. Us. But now, you ever listen to the Silver Shroud? 
<laughs> That's what we need. No matter how bleak things got, he saved the day. My family and I used to listen to every new episode. You mean when they first aired? How? The last broadcast was hundreds of years ago. I was in cryogenic storage for a long time. I only just woke up. Oh man, that's amazing! It's just like Mr. Abominable from episode 83. Wasn't he... a caveman? Yeah, that's the one. They found him in an iceberg off the harbor. Boy, if you just woke up. The world these days must take some getting used to. It seems like people are finally 